Welcome to BOJ TV's Scoopy Loopy, your news now. The police have stated that the guns seen in the picture circulating of dancehall artist Calado are fake. The photograph was suggesting that Calado had been arrested after being caught by the police with guns. This has been confirmed to be a rumor by the police. The guns were just props to be used for a video shoot. The Jamaica Observer recently reported that highly placed sources are suggesting that the government is about to put the troubled state-run Petrojam refinery up for sale. More info to come on that later. The head of the Seismic Research Center, SRC, at the St. Augustine campus of the University of the West Indies, Dr. Joan Lutchman, is calling for the region to be prepared for a major earthquake after several parts of the Caribbean have been jolted by tremors in recent times. According to a report made by the Jamaica Gleaner, Harborview head coach and reggae boys legend Ricardo Bibby Gardner will today offer his resignation to the club following a string of poor results. And finally, the Child Protection and Family Services Agency, CPFSA, has extended the application deadline for its Take a Child Home for Christmas program to this Friday, December 14th at 3 p.m. The program, which began more than 10 years ago, allows persons to host a child or children from state care at their home for a day or longer period during the Christmas season. And that's it for BOJ TV Scoopy Loopy. Join us tomorrow morning for your next news updates.